Tottenham's position on Antonio Conte future explained with four players behind anger. Tottenham are expecting Antonio Conte to stay despite the Italian slamming the club in the wake of their 1-0 defeat to Burnley on Wednesday. Ben Mee scored the only goal of the game at Turf Moor to boost the Clarets' chances of staying in the Premier League. Yet, for Spurs, it was another blow to their hopes of securing Champions League qualification. Tottenham went into their game against Burnley on a high after a pulsating victory over Manchester City last time out. Yet Spurs were unable to claim victory at Turf Moor, losing 1-0 on a chastening night at the office. In the aftermath, Conte hit out at his Tottenham players and the club's hierarchy by saying, I have to talk to the club. I am too honest to close my eyes and continue in this way and also take my salary. I want to take my responsibility. I am open for every decision because I want to help Tottenham. Four defeats in the last five games, this is the first time in my life this type of situation has happened. This is unacceptable. Think you know sport? Test your sporting knowledge with our tricky quiz I came in to try and improve the situation with Tottenham, but maybe in this moment, I am not so good to improve it. I'm trying to do everything to change the situation, but the situation is not changing. Someone has to speak about the race for the fourth place, and the reality from the last five games is we have to pay attention to not fight for the relegation zone. This is the truth, this is the reality, and when this type of situation happens, maybe there is something wrong. I'm too honest to close my eyes and to continue to say, OK I want to finish the season in this way and OK my salary is good. I want to make an assessment with the club. Don't miss Arnold ready to bin off second glazer policy at Man United Kylian Mbappe could give Tottenham glorious transfer chance Barcelona star De Jong ends Klopp transfer message, yet the Daily Mail say that, despite Conte's comments, Tottenham are expecting him to stay put. The former Inter Milan and Chelsea boss only took over in November to succeed Nuno Espirito Santo, who had seen his side sit just eighth in the table. Ironically, that's where Tottenham are now. The publication says that he's still furious after missing out on Luis Diaz and Adama Traer, who were both targets in January. Diaz ended up moving to Liverpool instead, while Traer moved from Wolves to Barcelona on loan. Want the latest football news? Join our brand new Facebook group by clicking here Conte's anger also stems from the club landing not ready replacements for Del Alli and Tangay Ndombele and Dijan Kulusevski and Rodrigo Bentancur. However, Tottenham fans fearing the worst can breathe a sigh of relief for the time being. Conte is set to hold talks with Tottenham soon enough, and he'll want guarantees he'll get the backing he craves. Whether Daniel Levy can convince him that will happen, however, is something only time will tell. Newcastle legend Shea Given, meanwhile, feels Conte may be angling to leave because of Manchester United. My concern is, has he got something else lined up, he told TalkSport. For a manager that's reportedly on pounds 15 million a year, which is a massive contract, he looks like he wants to walk away from this to be honest with you. When you come out with comments like that last night it looks like he's itching to get away from the place. And then we talked about Man United, I just think there's a perfect fit there. Maybe, just maybe, someone from the red side of Manchester will be in contact with him, because it feels like Man United need a character like him, that's really strong to sort that dressing room out.